guys happy saturday i hope you guys watch this on the replay and you guys are doing something wonderful on this beautiful spring day happy mother's day every all the mothers out there i'm seriously over here breathless um <laughs> there have been uh several developments in the last 20 minutes i just pulled the most amazing card for that a direct market person ever needs to hear from a deck on a Facebook Live. Um, I was talking about being hesitant about sharing two brands because I really, I said, nothing makes me uncomfortable. And I was like, well, it's really put, you know, being a direct marketer for two brands at once makes me hesitant. And then I pulled the most like God smacking card out of the deck like I, I think I did with you guys. I pulled a card out and I have to read it out loud. Um, and then I'm gonna, I took a picture of it of course and I put it in my little Zen garden and it's my, that's, it becomes, this becomes my reference too. I'm on the go, I go to my, where I took a picture. I take pictures. I live my whole life in pictures. So this card said, Lord help me be less concerned with what people think of me and more concerned with what they experience of you through me. Ooh, I don't know if that, <laughs> I don't know if, if that is as powerful for you guys as it is for me, but it is completely like I was literally saying that I can't be made uncomfortable. And then I was like, well, it, I think it just confuses people. I think sometimes we represent two different brands, but these complement each other really well, but I am still hesitant. And then now I'm not, okay, Lord heard. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Lord. Because you say so, I will. James 5 5. <laughs> okay, the Lord is showing up today in a big way. Okay, and then I was opening a pack of cards, which I have the <laughs> package in your ear. Like, I'm opening these cards because I want to be able to show you, um, you guys. So, the other day, um, Robin and I were met. I think I'm really sure this is Robin. And please, Robin, <laughs> tell me I'm not crazy. Or tell me I am crazy. I don't know. I, I am. I, I'm, I'm crazy. But. <laughs> Okay, so for some reason I responded to her with God always writes the best love stories and it's something that I well actually Sarah Sarah Johnson a long time ago whatever she said it the first time and then I said you know it is he does write the best love stories that is a very true statement <laughs> Jesus I said God writes the best love stories and then I opened this I have no idea what Studio 71 cards are, by the way. I've, I'll, maybe I'll look it up now. But I just opened this package because I wanted you guys to be able to show, see um, some of the coolness of it. Because it's not, um, they're not always like super extra churchy either. They're not, you know, some of them are not too much. And some of them laid on heavy, you know. Um, which I, I'm all over the spectrum, really. Okay, so this is the card that was on top. The second card... In the Studio 71 collection is God Writes the Best Love Stories. Oh my gosh. You guys. So, <laughs> we were meant to have this party. Please, please get some of this message in your home. He continuously shows up through it. And I'm having the best time. I'm having the time of my life. So, you guys, <laughs> come get blessed with me. And check out those check out those kits. I'm serious. The price of those kits is um, amazing. <laughs> I'm telling you, you want some of this stuff in your home. You want if you want to feel the spirit move. You think you think more. Yeah, you think more on the topic. Woo! All right. Thanks, you guys. I'll see you soon.